we're at Pass of Balata, just underneath Razor's Edge. And this is a really nice example of Hertzian fracturing. And this is how granular systems fail. It's also why you don't put very small nuts into placements if you can put a larger one in. Because you see up here, big block supporting a much larger block on top of it here, but it's only supporting at this edge here. And so the stress is just being supported by this bit. So rather than the pressure being over the full width of the block, it's just over that little bit there. And actually the stress there is higher than the breaking stress of the rock. So you can see there's a fracture that's running down, propagating into the rock. It stops about here somewhere by my finger. And so this is being caused by the overstress of this block on top of it. Eventually that fracture will propagate out into this edge and the whole bit will spall off. And at that point, what's going to happen? Well, this is no longer going to be supported and so that block will fall, the block above it will fall and perhaps there'll be catastrophic failure. If you can imagine having a climbing nut just on a little like quartz nubbin, exactly the same thing's happening. You're making a very high stress intensity at that little little quartz crystal and so that'll break off much more easily than if you can get a large thing in which is supported over a large area. And in fact the guidebook <laughs> says of this thing that the crevasse at the top appears to be widening. Probably this kind of Hertzian fracturing, you can see it's already happened once here, is the reason that this is all tilting off and is going to fail at some point.